Thank, thank you, Mr. Chairman. I, I would like to uh, speak to my amendment and also the resolution itself on SCON 49, the patrimony resolution. I'd like to thank the chairman and vice chairman. My amendment is uh, very simple that would clarify the definition of Native American to be consistent with other legislation as it pertains to consultation. Lastly, my amendment changes the call for a GAO study and instead supports their ongoing efforts. Again, appreciate the chairman and vice chairman working with me on this issue. And, and briefly, I want to thank my colleagues, Senator McCain and Senator Heinrich, for joining me as original co-sponsors of this resolution. In New Mexico, we have a rich cultural history rooted in Native American tradition that is the bedrock of who we are as New Mexicans. Our 23 tribes enrich us, which is why it's particularly disturbing for me that a few people have exploited the loopholes in current laws meant to stop the theft of important cultural items and have exported uh, deeply important sacred objects to other countries to be sold as art. These items are not pieces of art. They are sacred objects, deeply important for tribal identity, and we need to put a stop to the trafficking of these objects. My resolution strongly condemns the theft, illegal possession or sale, and export of tribal cultural items. Additionally, it calls on federal agencies to take affirmative action to stop the aforementioned practices and work to secure repatriation of tribal cultural items back to tribes. Earlier this year, I raised this issue with Secretary Jewell and asked the Department of Interior to work on this issue as part of their trust responsibility. We had a recent hopeful story working with the Pueblo of Acoma. An upcoming auction of the Acoma Shield in Paris was canceled after outreach by myself, Senator Heinrich, and other U.S. Governor of government officials to the auction house and to French officials. Our resolution today also encourages state and local governments, along with groups and organizations, to work cooperatively in deterring these practices. This is a problem that affects all of us, and we need to work collectively to put a stop to this. Again, I appreciate the chairman and vice chairman for working with me on this issue and respectfully request the committee's approval. Yield uh, back. Thank you, Senator Udall. Any other senators Mr. like to chairman. make an opening statement? Senator McCain. Mr. Chairman, I'd like to associate myself with the remarks of Senator Udall. This is